Right, okay, so this time I'm going to talk to you. I mentioned uh, on the last one I did, or an earlier one, I was talking about how there was a train station in Junction Road. So I'm standing on Junction Road and I'm on the road bridge that goes over the railway. And you can see over my shoulder, that's towards, that's a bus. One of those horrible Heatherwick buses. That's, I'm open for conversation on that, I don't like them. Um, that takes us to Tufnell Park, sorry doesn't take us to Tufnell Park, that's uh, Archway down that way, the, uh, I, because I was looking in the opposite direction, and then back this way takes us to Tufnell Park. Now, if you were Victorian and you lived in this area and you wanted to get around the country by rail, you would have picked up your train from here, from the access road down the side here where there was a train station. Um, because this is before the tube lines came in and say so you've got tube lines at either end of Junction Road. Um, and I'm going to turn the camera around for you. Whoops. Can you see in here and over here? There's the railway line. So the line is that the station platform would have been just down the side over here it's really quite hard to make out but what we're going to do is just going to walk down the road here and we can be a big pretend i've got some big bustly dress on and a hat and some sort of stiffly starched blouse perhaps with a parasol i don't know and uh, we would have walked down here down station road because it leads to the station you know it does what it says on the tin so we would have ambled down here and we would have uh, picked up the uh, train from down here. Now, um, what's quite good about it is that uh, it's been pointed out that there was a junction box down there on the railway line. And this being Junction Road and Junction Road Station, you would have had Junction Road Junction Box. It's quite nice, isn't it? Junction Road Junction Box. So let's cross the road. So the station, we're kind of halfway down the road. So the road goes down into the distance down that way. And looking back up to Tufton Park Road. Oh my God, I keep giving you the wrong names. Junction Road. I'm not going to redo this. This is life. This is human. Mistakes happen. Um, oh, interesting flues on these buildings here, coming down at the back. So they interesting. The way the flues on the extensions at the back of the house, which would have been built later, the way they've put the chimney flues that reach down, great chunky, great things. Anyway, so back to what I was talking about. So the station on the other side of the road would have been more or less over there where I'm pointing now on the other side of the road so you would have gone in here to get your train because here you can see a little bit wider there's still sort of vestiges of little bits of hardcore in there if you look start looking really hard but that's kind of where the platforms would have been what I want to do is walk along the road and show you some other bits and pieces. I hope I'm getting this right because I stupidly put the camera the wrong way around before I started. So on the other side of the road here, we get this access to Hungerford Road. And there are some really beautiful brickwork. And I do like a bit of brickwork. So if we see here, we've got these fantastic buildings here. Check out this lovely brickwork. And if you look at the house at the end, really nice. I hope I'm getting this right because I can't see what I'm doing. Um, 